Hello. <laughs> I'm Richard Bobes, the Bald Explorer, with the lovely Richard Suggett. Hello, Richard. Hello, Richard. We're standing in a car park in, oh, wait, tip shelf. Tip shelf, that's Off it. the M1. What the hell are we doing there in jolly old, Wor in jolly old Worthing, jolly old England? We are on a secret mission. We can't tell you what we're doing. We're off to buy a van. Well, maybe. <laughs> oh, wait, have I just given the secret away? Yep. Oh, what a twerp. Well, you've, been, you've been holding on to that this whole trip. That's what I, we're doing. That's what we did. Did I not tell you? No, I had oh. no idea. You just told me to navigate. Yes, navigate up the M1. Now, we know that as we're driving, there are these weird tier systems going on in the world where you can and can't go. Fear not, we're not going in, in one of those. We've been watching the news. Um, monitoring closely. And monitoring closely, otherwise we wouldn't have left. Um, but you'll be pleased to know that in our pockets we do have the necessary gags so that uh, we can't tell too many bad jokes. I think that's, that is the concept. So um, we're not going to hang about here because it's actually raining. But I do want to show you, come this way Richard, I do want to show you that there's the car behind me and uh, just this side of this hedge Sorry Richard, he's, he is coming, look, there is the service station. So, um, but we're not actually using the service station as such. No, we've brought snacks and coffee along with us to save us going inside. Yeah, so we're ever so clever. So we've got a little bit more driving to do, which we will do. And um, hopefully we will go and investigate the van and you guys will see it before anybody else does. Before Except us even. Me. Yeah, no, you'll see it before, yeah. yeah. Mr. Suggett is here to make sure I don't uh, buy a load of old nonsense. Did you know? Now you tell me. Oh. <laughs> oh well, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. Right, right, we better get moving. Let's do it. <laughs> it's the next day. We got here. We got here. We've been to the B&B, we've kipped separate rooms and we've showered we've washed we've had breakfast and we've been excited and the anticipation has been ecstatic ecstatic and we've decided not to buy it so <laughs> we're going home no no wait no 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 that's not quite true we have now well, i say we actually you, you. <laughs> I, yeah you wouldn't pay anything i wouldn't pay anything no it was i was like help help them drive it so no, that's true i was gonna say help a man out here <laughs> so he said no i'm not putting any money towards this i'm driving your old wreck home so yeah all right so in front of us you can't see it yet but in front of us is my new van the bald explorer new van and it's good you love it don't you i love it so shall we have a look let's shall have we a show, look we'll show you so um here we go we're going to move the camera around here and it's just that's the back end, the back end. Um, which is quite nice <laughs> um, now if you open the door Sorry in the back the we're going to show you in reverse order so, so here we go this is in the back of the van and so richard if i can just move the camera around explain what's going on here so this would be the storage area where richard would keep cameras or clothing equipment and, and things like that so it's all set up with these these little boxes that all fit into place quite nicely all in there um i mean i don't know what more i can say about it it's yeah so there's a storage, storage space we've got the spare tire um there's a free umbrella with this model of vehicle keep which, your hair dry yeah because <laughs> obviously you know it gets very wet in my head um steering lock all of that so if anybody's watching yeah. this and you're trying to nick the van don't don't um, so that's really nice and we've got two open doors and I can sit on the lip at the back there have a little trestle table in front Richard is demonstrating and I can cook my meals when I'm out there in the middle of nowhere have in the great wilds and what and, and have, have a, a shave right? yeah did you ever shave this morning no I didn't no. No. <laughs> <laughs> fantastic so that's really exciting we're going to go around the other side and show you some more of the wonderful sights of this new uh, expensive but worthwhile van so come with us so here's the side of a van as you can see it, it's a black transit custom limited edition um, two people in the door yeah and if you look at how clean it is 
and I've been advised that I've got to keep it clean or else the previous owner will be on my back about it. So we have a window in the side. Is there is, there. which is there. We can't open it at the moment. No, because it opens from the inside, which is like <laughs> usual. And on the inside, we have this rather interesting effect. So I'm going to give you the camera to hold and you'll be able to see me by doing yeah. that. Okay. And I should climb in. So this is the sort of living, the living space. Actually, just as you do that, come just a bit, a bit closer because I'm just going to refocus it a bit. I'm going to move so, back just to, to see more. See so more. this is the, like the living space and the great thing it's got this wonderful upholstered, upholstered padded seat that I can recline in. If I want to do some edits or have breakfast or something I've got this fantastic desk here or table which folds away against the bulkhead which is very lovely. Just the other side of there I have a loo, I won't go into too much detail. There's a, a radiator here on the side, a little heater, which is excellent. Um, but the, the piece de resistance here, and I'm going to take my shoes off because this van is so clean, um, is my bunk with a lovely mattress. So I'm just going to clamber in and you do it like this. And, and here I am, ready for the night whilst I have a snooze. And then in the morning, I can get up and I can get those wonderful sunsets in different parts of this wonderful land. How exciting. And to get out. And to get out. It's very easy. Being an agile young fella, my lad, I can do it. I just shove my shoes back in. So it's really, really really handy and hang on i nearly got my shoes back on are you all right it's quite heavy that camera isn't it does it? get heavy doesn't yeah. it yeah i'll come around here because if i open up this end i'm going to run around the other You're side run and here is the control center where I will be driving to and from the locations, cameras in the back, bed and all of that in the back, uh, the, the lovely Julia or the lovely Richard or whoever's with me or just me driving along to and from location, doing the filming. If I want to do some editing, I can in the back and it's great. I'll come around now and relieve you of the camera, Richard, and get your thoughts on everything. So Richard. Richard. Yes, Richard. <laughs> yes, Richard. <laughs> what do you think? Uh, I'm very jealous. Are you? I'm very jealous. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing and so immaculate. It is so immaculate. I am very, very lucky to have found our mystery seller um, who actually watches our stuff and um, he's mad. <laughs> 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 um, but I'm so thrilled. And it's nice that I think in some ways that he knows the brand and he knows what I do and he can follow the adventures and follow his van too. Tell you to keep it clean as well. And yes, tell me <laughs> to keep it clean, which is something I would endeavour to do. But it's a fantastic van. You will see um, obviously it, it, it in the show, um, but it's not going to be the be all and end all of the Ball Explorer. It's just my modus of upper, my modus of your, your mode of transport. Yes, exactly. That's it. So, so what are your plans with it, really? Well, my plans now are to be able to go places, stay overnight and get more content without having to rush back. Right. I know we're going into winter as we record this. And so obviously the light is going to be darker in the mornings and early darkness at night. But um, I will try and maximise and get sunsets, sunrises and just be more on location and not have to worry, not just be in Sussex and within the local area. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping next week to do a, a bit of a mini test on all of this. So keep watching because I'm going to try it out and surreptitiously stay the night and I'll bring you the, the details of it when I do in my van. I look forward to that. 
Meanwhile, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoy it. And if you've enjoyed the video, give us a thumbs up. Thanks to uh, Richard for uh, um, coming and uh, proving of everything and holding my hand, if you have a bit, because I was very nervous about the whole thing. Um, it's a, it is quite a big purchase for me. A lot of people know I'm not very <laughs> good at spending money. But it's a skin, yeah, thanks. <laughs> but it's an investment on the, on the series. And a big thank you to our mystery um, seller who is just off camera. Thank you very much to him. Um, it's not Eric. It's not Eric. No, it's not Eric. So anyway, see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Leave a comment, make a suggestion, become a, a patron, help me pay for the van. No, no. <laughs> and I will see you on the next one. Until then, bye-bye. Time for bird watching. Yeah, bird watching.